funniest pets and people. The cat's out of the bag. A deer without fear. A dumbbell drops one. And a baby plays spin the bottle. So settle down. Because we're going to tickle your funny bone. It's the show that will have you sick. Stay, laugh, and beg for more. Welcome to Funniest Pets and People. They don't get all wound up laughing. It's toys. Cats are fast, agile, and they can jump. But just forget about them as your partner in a sack race. <laughs> it may have a classy cast, but based on this preview, we think we're going to skip the planned sequel to Jarhead. This cat is in training. Hey, without three hours of practice a day, you don't become champion drape shredder of the county, okay? <laughs> Future dog looked around the quaint living room and thought about how backward it all was. And then he remembered. He had to get going. There was a space bone that needed burying. Okay, the dog looked silly, but just three more days and he'd be allowed to join the dog fraternity. <laughs> you see a cat playing with a tissue box. He sees, well, he sees nothing. He's got his head in a tissue box. <laughs> it was only after Dexter and Bobo got started that it hit him. You need three dogs to play jump rope. Now, we know this is a female ferret because she keeps asking, Does the watering can make me look fat? Somehow or another, Mendel Birnbaum's very first attempt at speed dating went horribly awry. Start smiling, we're in for good times. You 
Using the vacuum on the cat did seem extreme, but it worked out way better than when she tried to use the feather duster. The dog had tried blind dates, speed dating, and the internet. And wouldn't you know it, love was right under his snout. The couple's new masked cake delivery service was not only novel, it was necessary. The dog never really knew if the cat was serious during these fights because, frankly, the cat was always pulling his leg. Marty was so funny with his jokes and his stories, he, he had the entire room cracking up. <laughs> Literally. <laughs> Next time, Sheila should consider climbing on the table before eating a big dinner. This was the last time Ed would try to help his sore back with Rick's new Baco rub. <laughs> Rick's Baco rub with the soothing scent of bacon. <laughs> Curiosity not only didn't kill the cat, it won him one of our t-shirts. <laughs> Coming up. A loopy lap dog. And a woman is three sheets to the floor. When we return to funniest pets and people. Welcome back to funniest pets and people. Take off your shoes, it's time for some indoor fun. Waldo was so excited his owners let him turn on the bath, he didn't stop to think he was turning on the bath. <laughs> Some dogs are destined to win the Iditarod. Others are destined to watch it on TV. We'll let you guess which dog this is. If the ceiling of your home shatters when it's hit by a champagne cork, then maybe you have less to celebrate than you think. You know what this cat is thinking? Two words. Got milk.
This is it, Rocco. But I want you to go on without me. No, I insist. I'll just slow you down. Oh, you could do it. There ain't a fenced living room built that could hold you. That's it. You're making it. Have a pizza crust from the garbage for me, pal. Woohoo! <laughs> this baby cannot find his balloon. Where's my balloon? Anybody see my balloon? Oh, yeah, like I'm gonna believe that. It's not on my head, you dope. Where's my balloon? Hey, where? Really? No, not there. Wait. Oh, it is! <laughs> Take it from this stilt walker. Forget the top. It's lonely and painful at the bottom. Can you blame this pig for moping around? Her owner spent two weeks in Hawaii living large, and all she got was that lousy leg. This video of the cat sneaking around in the kitchen where he's not supposed to be makes a lot more sense when you realize <laughs> it's being taped by the dog. <laughs> On the downside, that was the third mobile she broke this month. <laughs> Upside, the Pilates was working wonders. <laughs> it's funniest pets and people unleashed. <laughs> now, granted, this is a weird position to sleep in, but in all fairness, Kitty knocked himself out. <laughs> Sleeping 12 hours on top of the TV. <laughs> That's hard work. This is how Buster reacts to a new stuffed dog. They should pretty much forget about bringing in that Great Dane. signs were all there that they were falling for each other. Well, like the one that said, freshly waxed floor. <laughs> there were so many mismatches on the first try that Morris decided, that's it, no more internet dating. This was a first for the cat, because up till now, he had always been the crabbiest one at the family picnic. The next time you play this game, insist on 300 thread count sheets, at least.
Jerry's not complaining. Well, not because he's good-natured. It's because when you've been dieting, powdered sugar tastes great. Hey, we've seen some bad reactions to a haircut, but uh, this is this is ridiculous. steps back and breaks his mother's back when we return to Funniest Pets and People. Welcome back to Funniest Pets and People. Loosen up your tie and smile. It's time to make yourself comfortable. Little Lee gets to spend the afternoon watching cartoons because he's finished his chores. And as for the cat? Well, sleeping on the couch is his chore. <laughs> Not in a hat. Beneath a chair with a strange stare. If you are scared, then stop this chat and go and find a normal cat. After weeks of rehearsal, the cat gerbil ventriloquism act hit a snag when they realized that neither of them could talk. trotters and mutters, this is a lounger. clever attempt, but hiding between the cushions didn't conceal the fact that the dog was on the couch. <laughs> Build, Build up those smiling muscles, it's time for exercise. <laughs> Message to the lizard. If you want to figure out how to jump out of bed, check out the woman who just woke up and saw you. <laughs> now we know why the chicken didn't cross the road.
Next time, they should think twice about having a sack race with giant kibble bags. <laughs> Ironically, he joined the gym to drop some weight. Yeah. Guess he's getting his money's worth. How did all this get started? Well, apparently one dog had a bone to pick and the other one wanted it. Coming up, a couple of bobble-headed buddies. When we return to Funniest Pets and People. Welcome back to Funniest Pets and People. After driving around for three hours, these pups just couldn't remember if you had to make a left turn or a right turn to get to the dog park. See you next time. <laughs>